I guess that would work out alright if we only added parts to them and everything. Mm. So, what sometimes he said, he said, key to that door, I think he said the key to that door. Okay, we're going to attempt to make a little trip in this boat. Nothing far, doesn't have the batteries in it yet. However, I've got blue skies, lots of sun, the motor appears to work, the pedals appear to work, so we're going to give it a little test. Not going far enough that I couldn't paddle back, you know, if I had to. But I, I think everything should work fine. So I, turned the, I turned my big switch on there, and the motor was going not as fast as I thought it should. And I do only have four out of the six solar panels connected. But still, I was like, it should be going faster. So I looked up, and the, the, the solar panels were covered in leaves. So I went up and wiped all the leaves off. It's so nice being able to stand up on the roof and get the leaves off easily. Anyway, now this seems like it's going about right. How are the pedals, Bells? Good? I can't wait to get our cool seats here, but right now I can just sit on here and everything seems to be functioning well. With, uh, with the boat actually moving, there's a lot less splashing from the, the paddle wheel. Even when I was on it, let me get my, let me get my butt on it. Yeah, it's not splashing nearly as much, but pay attention so I don't crash. So now I'm just waiting for the batteries and the charge controller. But everything everything seems to be functioning well enough to, to move anyway. Oh, I also need to finish the, the floorboards. So these are some of the old floorboards. And up there I have a couple more floorboards, but you know, I have to finish them all. And in the front there are no, no floorboards at all yet. So I have to fill all those in. But that's minor stuff. All right, I do want to test something. If nobody's pedaling, can I get all the pedals out of the water? Not quite. Although, if there's some weight in the front of the boat, uh, the back of the boat would get higher. I could probably get all four paddles out of the water when I'm driving. Because right now, you know, it's idle and they're, they're paddling. Although that's, that's not gonna make that much resistance for the boat. These, these spin pretty freely. It's a ghost. It is, it is ghost pedaling now, yeah. But I kind of want to make it so I can get the paddles totally out of the water when we're not using them. When we're just driving off motor. I could take the bolts out that hold the, the, the paddle thing or the, the whole pedal, whatever, whatever you call this, module down so the front could tip up. And then... Yeah, I could just change the height of it whenever I want. Right now it's just bolted down. And I'm not going to worry about it because it's a pretty minor thing. Okay, let's just get some driving. Aura, right, make sure this does not fall in the water. Thanks.
apparently I made these two paddles kind of farther apart than the other ones. So as long as they're down, they're not in the water. I totally did that by accident, but I should have done it on purpose. And it looks like, like it's weighted well enough that way that they'll stay there. So that's great. Oh, I'm not ready to go out there just yet. There's a pretty stiff wind right now. But uh, I'm still, I'm driving straight into the wind right now, actually. And I'm still making progress, which is good. Even on the motor, maybe half powered. I think I'm gonna go do some pedaling though, so I can get home a little faster. Got me home in one piece. I think that's a pretty good test. Everything seems to work. So I just need uh, the batteries to show up and the charge controller. And uh, yeah, then I can put it together and it should be good. The motor does make a little bit more of a grinding sound than I would like. But I don't know if that's just some, it might just be something, I don't know, some bits in there. Or it might be a bigger problem. But uh, I mean, I have had that motor for a pretty long time. So, I don't know, I'm just gonna drive it, see how it goes. The pedals on this boat are much less useful. They're still useful, uh, particularly when I was driving through a cloud. Not I was through a cloud, but I was driving under a cloud and it had a lot less sun to the motor. And I pedaled and it helped a lot. Uh, I did try just pedaling without the motor. And I can definitely move the boat. It's just, I'm not going like miles in it that way, you know. If I had an emergency situation where the motor died and I had to get back to some land, I, I, I could probably be fine with just pedaling. My smaller boat, I can pedal like a 35, 40 mile trip. You know, it takes all day and it's exhausting, but I can do it. This boat, pfft, no. It's just, a, it's just a lot bigger 